55 in it. Um, it's the second generation Oldfield Toronado. 455? Yeah, 455. We found this one a couple of months ago. Well, not even that, maybe six weeks ago. And we're going to start it up. Things in great shape. It's been pretty well taken care of. I mean, it needs some work, obviously. I mean, shot on the front end. It's, it's uh, unique to uh, 71 and 72, this front bumper. 73 they come out with the federally mandated bigger bumpers and they don't look as good with the bigger bumpers. Let's give her a go and she'll start. seen these in a while. Yeah, we're not very organized. Just moved in, so we're getting this place. That wheel's not like that. It's a little crooked, isn't it? Things running on propane. Nine, Coupe de Ville. Yeah, the poor thing sitting out in the weather. The last year or so, it got to be in the tent. We couldn't really film this car much, did we? Yeah, because we hit it in the tent.
interior work. The body's pretty solid, actually. Yeah. Tarps aren't staying on very good. I think we've showed this one. We haven't shown this one for sure. It's the 73 Coronado. Here's the Riviera. And then you've seen those. Choke isn't working. this up yeah, this one off. get a shot of that switch there was a guy wondering how he started this that's the uh, ignition switch right here that sits on top of the steering column and the ignition is messed up inside I gotta take it all apart to fix it but you can start your car if you take the switch off the top of the column and use a screwdriver to go through the That's probably the end of this video. We'll try and get some more going here as we progress with work. And uh, Kyle's just gonna try out the Jimmy, drive it around a little bit. Right, Cosmo? Huh? What do you think? Go for a ride? Huh? <clears throat> We've got still more work to do to this one. But we got the front end back together. 74 GMC Jimmy. This is the one we took. Our, we took actually the engine out of uh, an 87 Suburban, a 305, just till we get this one rebuilt. This Jimmy came with an original 350 four speed and it's still a four speed we took the 305 out of that old suburban over there with the doors off and uh i think the thing seems to be running pretty good 350 though will work a little better a little more reliable tougher motor So 
So until the next video, everybody take care. You got anything to say? Yeah. Bye for now. <laughs>